What up, YouTube? Today is a beautiful day. Sunny outside, feeling blessed, feeling healthy. The benders fucking really did a number on me. So it feels good to be back home, you know, dialed in healthy. This is, the bulk has begun. We just smacked a little MK. But what are we getting ourselves into today? Wouldn't you like to know? A bunch of, bunch of cool shit today. Um, we're gonna hit legs. We're gonna do Rich Piana's leg day at Planet Fitness. Throughout the day, we're also gonna be doing <clears throat> a full day of eating. So what did we get? Sugar-free Red Bull, for starters. Pre-workout is gonna be a rain energy drink. You need Tums on the bulk when you eat like a fucking retard like myself. Breakfast is gonna consist of A bigger plate from Panda Express, teriyaki chicken, orange chicken chow mein, green beans and chicken, and then a burrito from Chipotle. Always double wrap your burritos, always double meat. Probably like 1,500 calories in this, 2,000 calories in the Panda Express. It's not easy, guys. This is how far we are into the Panda. The Rito needs work. So we're getting ready for the gym. I'm gonna spank this guy now which is a total of 420 milligrams of caffeine with the Red Bull. Um, and I went to my doctor and she said that I could drink 400 a day. So if the doctor says 400 is okay, you can realistically expect that 600 to 700 milligrams of caffeine would be okay because doctors are pussies. I was also mapping out the leg workout for today. Rich Piana's leg day. We are copying this one. Bigger by the day. Day 16, big leg day. Gold's gym, 30 pounds. Um, he doesn't go over the sets and reps, but they, I wrote down what he did in that video. He starts off with hamstrings. He does a fuck ton of hamstrings. So two hamstring curl variations, barbell RDLs, then leg extensions, then leg press, then hack squat, which is pretty fucking retarded if you ask me. I don't know why you would start with the accessories and the isolation movements and then move into the compounds. That uh, doesn't make any fucking sense. But either way, we're gonna fucking do Rich's leg day because at the end of the day, I can talk like a fucking science nerd all I want. Rich Piana is five times bigger than me. Like, I, I really have nothing to say about it other than we're gonna do his workout. Mm -hmm. If you guys are watching this, that means we cashed the roulette spin. So congratulations. And I already know we cashed it, you know, because black is a lock 50% of the time. Before we got, we're uh, snacking on a couple Samoas. Them Girl, Sto Girl Scout bitches. Well, not these girls, not bitches. Referring to the cookies. And then uh, pre-workout uh, applesauce. And since we don't know the sets and reps of our leg day, we're gonna determine that with Fortnite. We'll start off with eight sets. I have to do eight sets of each workout. But every kill that I get, you know, drops it down to seven. And then if I get three kills, we do five sets. If I do four, get four kills, it's fucking four sets, you know? If I get a victory royale with more than eight kills, we're hitting fucking arms. Fuck legs, you know what I mean? Kind of one of those things, because I've earned it at that point. And I'll be honest with you guys, I'm dirty nasty at Fortnite. I know I'm gonna get a lot of comments about how I'm dog shit at Fortnite. I'll dog every one of you. I even pay you guys if you beat me, because I'm just Dr. fucking Disgust Balls over here. Full box, double edit. Shit on, nerd. You know, a little bit of that business. All up in your fucking face. We'll say, we'll say the minimum amount of sets that I can do is three because I don't want to go in there and just only do one or two sets. Um, I don't know how streamers talk and play, bro. I, I, even looting, it takes my full fucking attention. But, um... Come here, come here, little boy. Dogs, you're trash. Get full pieced. Bong water, dog shit. Oh, this is definitely an AI. I didn't even pick up the gun. Full box. Oh, what is my aim, dude? I take a potato. All right, two kills. Oh, people are gonna be talking shit about my lobbies. I can already, I can already fucking smell it. But you know, I'm just cracked, and I make it look easy. The Fortnite goat. That brings up another good thing. I, I, I'm going to be 
a professional Fortnite player. A lot of people think it's funny. What does this do? Oh, bounty. Um, but that's the goal, you know, that's the, the ultimate I made it moment. When I'm sitting in the Fortnite World Cup dogging Booga. Oh, oh, oh! my God, it's hot in my room. Oh shit. That was that was an embarrassing fucking um, performance right there. I almost got dogged by the straight bot. Oh, this looks like him. Where are you running to, brother? Dog, dog, that's what I'm fucking talking about. Full box, 200, 200. Oh yeah, dude, you shit on coming for them guts, boy. Gonna dog you in your face with the dirty nasty. Gonna get dog watered on your bong water, nerd. Oh! Fuck me. This guy's balls! 179, your one shot. Full box. You're dead, kid. Shit! Full box, 200. Double edited that nerd. Gongo style. Hit the go. Oh. Oh. oh, yeah. Here you go. Here it is. 127. 127. Oh. Oh, I just lagged off of that. Oh, on me. Why am I fucking lagging so hard? Alright, four more opponents! And then we're hitting arms, baby! I honestly, part of me hopes I don't win because I, I need to hit fucking legs at some point in my fucking life. Wow, I, these lobbies are fucking tistic. Two hundred. Two hundred. Check the six. Spidey senses picked that one up. Got nerd on the six. He's pushing now. Crank up. Oh, he's good. He's cracked. Hit him for one thirty or something. Healing up. Fuck, dude! Get off my Johnson McWillison. Alright. Watch this. That was a horrible fucking idea. Oh my god. I'm in trouble, fellas. This fucking train, dude! Get out of my way! I'm out of mats. How did I crank all my mats there? I need this so bad. And then get the mats. I'm so cracked. 
5,000 IQ. 5 million IQ. Then there's Bandos. Oh, we win these. We win this. That one guy's definitely better than me. I mean, no one's better than me. I can kill anyone. I could kill fucking Ninja if I wanted to. Booga these nuts, brother. That was a good fucking game, though. I, I now I have only have to do three sets of legs. All right, we're also gonna smack a uh, protein shake pre-gym. Check that out. What's good with that, Planet Fitness? With tiny mats. I'm oh yeah, dude, fuck these mats. There we go. Really underprepared. No honey, no salt. Just Panda Express and Chipotle. No Cialis. Didn't pin yet. Naughty workout as it gets. gonna hit calves, which Rich Grimey doesn't hit, but uh, what's his fucking face? Lee Priest? Yo! Lee Priest does seven sets of calves every day of the week, so we have to do uh, like fucking 30 sets of seven to make up for the last month, so. All right. Them bitches shaking, bro. Not gonna lie, those legs are looking a little natural right now. A little bit of Trimbalone Super Draw would be good. All right, uh, since I don't have a laying down leg curl, we're doing hamstring variation two. And usually I don't condone quick workouts, but when you're in Planet Fitness, you kinda gotta fucking, you know, work out to the level of equipment that you have. All right, we're not doing this. I'm like embarrassed to be on camera doing this bullshit. Alright, we're committed to the fucking Rich Piana leg day, and unfortunately, Planet Fitness is not pro Piana, so we're going to a different gym to fucking hit hack squats and leg curls, but we feel pretty damn good, oh, and core and calves. So really, we're only like halfway done. Alright. Alright, new gym alert. Check it out, Axis Fitness. Look at those tiny ass legs.
Fuck, we gotta hit calves. I forgot about that bullshit. Oh, fuck this. Why is it so long, bro? It's like I'm. Is that what, where do you fucking put your face on this bullshit, huh? Alright. Good. And I, correct me if I'm wrong, but Rich Piana did not do fucking cardio. Time to dirk the schmirk it, dirk it, dirk. Three packs of this oatmeal. And then we're doing a shake. We're gonna do some dairy free ice cream, peanut butter, nanner. And a little life hack they don't teach you in school is you don't gotta peel the banana when you're making a shake. It's a pretty good amount of ice cream. There we go. Fairlife protein shake. Smack that in there. Powdered greens, since I don't eat any real greens. Look at that. Sprinkle MK677. We have eaten, we're nourished, and I feel good, let me tell ya. We're winning back my fucking money, motherfuckers. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do this Snapchat giveaway. We're putting $300 on a roulette spin. <clears throat> 150 for you guys, 150 for me. If it hits, I'm giving away $150 to one of you guys. How do you enter, you might ask? Well, you have to add me on Snapchat. But boom it's right there. Go ahead and add it if you want. So to enter, you just swipe up when I post about it. So anyways, here we go, here we go. I tell how big the fucking bet is. Oh, here we go, $300 on black. Oh, this will get your fucking balls tangling, baby. Ladies and gentlemen, should we do something on like, oh wait, shit. We have $21 in case we lose. Oh, we're going, we're going. Whew. I am fucking pumped, baby. I'm kind of nervy too, though. I don't want to fucking, please. Oh, roulette, I would just want, ah. I'm so excited, oh, come on, give it to me, give it to me, get. Cause black is a lock. That's so gay, bro. All right, so we have $20. What are we gonna do with it? I know it's just never gonna hit. Oh! Is that cash? Bang! Bang! Let's go! Yeah, that's it. All right, cheers guys. Thank you so much for watching. We did a little more fitness in this video, so I hope you guys enjoyed the workout content. My legs are cheeched. Um, and as always, you know, thank you for the support. You guys are the ones that make this all possible for me. For me. I love you guys. I hope you have an amazing day. Become obsessed with your potential. You know, you should be sitting and staring at the ceiling at night, not giving a fuck about what people think, not giving a fuck about a bitch, but obsessed with what you can become and what you can do with your life because you know you have, you know, you know you have the tools and the potential to achieve anything the fuck that you want. You know deep down that you can do it. Dial it in and fucking commit to it. And that's a good point. A lot of people know that they deserve something, but they get stopped for two main reasons. Because they're afraid of what people are gonna think of them. And that's a bunch of bullshit. Toss that right out the fucking window. You should not give a fuck about what people have to say about you. Zero fucks. And number two, analysis paralysis. It's not gonna work out because of this or that, X, Y, A, A, B, C. It's gonna be too hard because the cash flow isn't there for the business. It's not a good idea because somebody already did the same idea. Oh, what a load of horse shit, dude. Just fucking do it. Even if you have no idea. Everything, every venture I've ever gone about in my life, I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing the whole time. It's just like, holy shit, I don't know what the fuck's going on, but here we go. I guess we're fucking doing it, bud. And that's how you learn. You fuck it up, and you're like, well, shit, man, now we know. And then, again, do it again and again and again and again. Eventually, it's guaranteed to work out for you. Guaranteed. 
Success can be guaranteed for every single one of you unless you literally die. And if you die, that's GG's, you know what I mean? All I'm trying to say, people, is go out and seize the fucking day. Caring what people think about you is like this massive weight on your shoulders. The second you really genuinely stop giving a fuck, it's like, whoa, holy shit, I can't believe I gave a fuck for that long. It feels amazing, motherfucker. The second that happens, you're in a positive feedback loop. Shit just starts working. You're like, holy shit, I love this, I wanna do this, I wanna do that. And all of a sudden, you're willing to work. All of a sudden, you're waking up at seven in the morning because you're fucking excited to get the day going because you get to work on shit that you love because you don't give a fuck what anybody has to think. If you're into fucking, you know, knitting, fuck it, whatever. You can become the knitting goat, become a knitting millionaire. You know, for me, that's pretty fucking gay. But it's like, you shouldn't care what I have to say because fuck me. It's about you. Your life is about you. Fuck what I have to say about it. Just by waking up, you are fucking blessed beyond your wildest imagination. You wake up and you're in somewhat good health, you are so fucking blessed. And don't let that go to waste. All right, I don't know how we got on that little rant. You know, I just got all worked up. I don't know how we got all worked up. I'm always worked up. I was just about to go on another rant right then. But the point is, I'm always fucking amped. I'm ramped. And you know why? I didn't used to be ramped up. I'm ramped up because I don't smoke weed anymore and I don't give a fuck about what people have to say about me. So I'm just pumped about what's going on at all times. It's like I'm on Schneefer goobs all the fucking time. Can you imagine how I fucking feel when I'm actually off the Schneefer goobs? Oh my God, dude, you don't want to be in the same room with me. I'd be talking about a million different businesses. I'll be executing. You know, everyone likes to rip Schneefer goobs and talk about a business. No, I'll do it right then and there. I'll start a fucking knitting Fortnite sweatshirt business club that night. That exact night. That's what it's all about, taking action, motherfuckers. If you have an idea, take action. Don't wait about it, don't think about it. Don't let anybody tell you your idea is stupid. Don't let yourself think too much about your idea. Fuck it, don't think at all. Just do it. If you think about anything for more than fucking 10, 15 minutes, you're gonna find so many problems that you're never gonna wanna do it. So just execute it. Wake up, I'm telling you, like, turn off this video. The second you're done watching this video, put down your phone and go do a whatever thing that you're thinking about right now. That business that you wanna start, your social media that you wanna fucking do. You wanna get in shape? How about you go to the gym right, right this fucking second? I don't care if it's 9 p.m. And just like that, I went on another rant. I don't know how that fucking happens. But anyways, thank you guys for watching my videos. I don't know where those rants came from, but I hope, you know, you guys somewhat um, get something out of my videos if it's a laugh or a little inspiration. Um, I hope I can, you know, provide some value to you guys' life. So anyways, thank you guys for so much for watching. I will catch you in three days for the next one. Mm -hmm.